Greetings Earthlings, I am Jared. I'm a professional appliance repairer with 100 years of experience, 10 years in this life, and many more years in each of my past lives, dating back to the Industrial Revolution. Uh, Pre-Industrial Revolution, I was most likely fixing carts and wagon wheels and things like that. Um, so, come with you today to show you the most common not draining faults for a dishwasher washing machine. It's not listed in your manual, but it's the first thing you should be checking. Um, only applies to underbench connections. If your washing machine hose goes up into the laundry tub at the top, this is not going to apply to that, but it will apply to every dishwasher and any washing machine with an underbench connection. So if you're ready to find out, follow me. Okay, me homie bombonis. Uh, first thing, get your kneeling pad. Let's shake the dishwasher. Boom, boom, boom. Come under the sink. Open it up. Dive in amongst the rubbish. Find the thing. This thing. Take the thing off of the other thing with this thing, or any flat blade, or a long nose pie if it's a clamp. Give it a wiggle, 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 wiggle it off. Uh, if it's an extension, you might need to poke a flathead under where my finger is there to loosen it up. They get super tight. Don't forget to bring your towel. Don't be like me. Always remember to bring a towel. Wise words. Uh, still looking for the towel. Where's that sneaky towel gone? Here it is. Pry it up. Get ready to catch the splash. No splash. Hang that up. Don't let it drop lots of water inside. Have a peek, sneaky peek. A little bit of food in there, but holes are clear. Here's a hole that's too small. Here's a hole full of gunk. Here's a perfectly cleared out hole. It's okay, we'll check the holes fine. If either solves your problem or you know that's not part of it, you can move on to the next troubleshooting step. Screw this back on, preferably not with the screw at the bottom, up to the side, but I don't care. Here is good. Nice and convenient to get the screwdriver on. Nice and tight. Not so tight it splits the rubber or crushes the plastic underneath it. Try her up. Check the leaks under here next time you run it. Sometimes these are in a really awkward spot. Can't quite get to it or even stick your phone camera in to take a picture of the hole. Uh, you can unscrew this if you need to. Can't get your drill in it to drill out the hole. Unclip the whole thing. Be careful that your vent's gonna have a lot of water. Don't try and tip it out into the sink that you just took it off of because it's gonna all fall down. Take it to a different sink. Screw back up, check the leaks, run the dishwasher, reset it to drain out as it's draining out. Check there's no water leaking out of there. All sweet. Good job. Otherwise, tighten it up more. You don't want to destroy your cupboard. Okay, thanks for watching. I hope this has helped you out. Again, this is just one common thing that gets overlooked because it's not in the in the appliance manuals for users to check. Um, so if this hasn't helped you out, 
maybe look elsewhere. I will be looking at making more of a, a deep dive video into Bosch dishwashers not draining specifically, and may also do a, a Breville coffee machine descale cleaning and a Breville hot water system cleaning and a split system cleaning, hopefully, if I stop being lazy every day. Um, and uh, da, 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 words, words, saying the words. Can you say your words? Let's say some words. Hey, hey, uh, pro tip before I go. Um, dishwashers are absolute pest magnets. Uh, cockroaches, mice, love them. In a humid climate, humid region where you get a lot of cockroaches, they're going to be drawn to your dishwasher. You need to, you won't even know they're there, so it's super important that you're getting some surface spray around the skirting boards of the kitchen, where the hoses connect behind the bench at least every six months, and getting your whole house done professionally, annually. It'll save you in the long run. Especially if you haven't had a pest control done for a little while, um, you'll have them come in, spray everywhere. You think you're all good. No problems. One week later, dead bugs everywhere. Where did they come from? They're hiding. Get it done, please. <laughs>